We have a rematch of last year's championship game between the Philadelphia Stars and the defending champs, those Birmingham Stallions, and some pyrotechnics on the way out as well. Calendar, it has turned to June. Both teams, they're back hunting as this countdown to kickoff is presented by Uber One. They are out for revenge. Philly gets the football first. Aubrey sends it deep, and Terry Wright on the other end of it for Philly. And here comes Wright going straight up through the defense team, and he is stopped up. In football, they run it. If not, they go up top. Cookus fires on the slant, and that is caught. It's Corey Coleman, and Corey Coleman is a former first-round pick in the NFL. Year one, he is a gritty quarterback out of Northern Arizona, and he broke his leg in that championship game. So he's got the metal rod in that leg now. And Oh, it's second and three, handed off to Colburn, and Colburn didn't like what he saw up the middle, bounces it to the outside, takes it inside the 30. Case did a great job right there. So initial spot, first down, they came back and reset it with his foot out, and now they're going to hand it off on a third and inches and down to the five-yard line. Spread it out, third and goal. Cook is flushed, has a guy wide open, and is caught for the touchdown. Ryan Izzo is tight end. The Philly Stars right down the home field of the Stallions for the opening touchdown. Right here, you're going to see Izzo. There he is right there. He's just going to go into the flat. Just a little bit of a pick play right there. Oh, yeah. Actually, he was supposed to be the, the guy that was shielding off the other receiver's defender. Uh, after the poll early, so we'll keep seeing. Thank you. Thank you. All right, Zora Case, thank you very much. And here is Deion Kane, who has been dangerous in the return game. Some of the best numbers of a return man in this league out to the 28. Ready, set. Alex Magoo, the quarterback, swings it to the outside. It's caught by LaMichael Petway. Petway with a nice stiff arm, and he makes his way down the sideline. And Magoo said, I love, love, love that guy right there. So he's a seventh-round pick, talking about Alex Magoo. Went to the Seahawks team that you are very familiar Absolutely. with in 2018 when he was picked. And he split time with Jamar Smith during that championship run of a season ago. He's a little upset right there. Converting over half their third downs. Magoo. And this is complete again. So those numbers will stay good. It's Deion Kane out of Clemson. Ready, set. Magoo. Plenty of time. Now he rolls. Buying more time. And Magoo looking for a receiver in the end zone. It's caught for the touchdown. Davion Davis bought about eight seconds scrambling around and then threw a dart to his favorite target, Davion Davis. Magoo. Okay, it's going to be a great pocket. You're going to see him get outside of the pocket just to buy a little bit more time, just to give his guys downfield an opportunity to uncover. And you can see that his receivers, Davion Davis, continue to work for him. He's the middle receiver. He has an outbreaking route. Sees his quarterback in trouble, goes back against the grain. I wouldn't. Here's Cookus, blitz coming, sees it, fires, complete. Corey Coleman hangs on through traffic. On that, I'm a little upset about that rule, but it is the reality. Marable gets the ball and does it. He fakes it. It's going to be Magoo on the end of the round, and that's what you mentioned, the power of that play. Right. Cookus fires, complete, down the sideline. There's more space there for Devin Gray as he's now going to take it out across the 25. Ready, set. Coming down to the two-minute warning. This football's loose. It's dropped. Magoo just lost the ball. And that is going to be recovered by the Stars. It's a huge mistake. Adam Rodriguez dives on top of it. It's Philly football. Why did he? Roshan. Now third and ten. Cookus has pressure off the edge. Fires into the end zone. It's caught for a touchdown. It's Corey Coleman who broke loose. Forget about the double team that time. He's all by himself. Catch it. Walk into the end zone. Sent the blitz from this side of the offense, allowing a big window for this glance post for Corey Coleman. He stays disciplined. He got inside of the defensive back. You almost feel sorry for Brian Mills right here on an island. Turbo set. Here's Magoo. Steps right through that pass rush, and then he is caught by it. 
but Brian Ray wasn't going to let him escape. Ready, set. To the air immediately, and it's LaMichael Petway with the catch with the first down, and he is rumbling that big body of his into the secondary before Channing Stribbling finally got him on the ground. He suffered that rib injury in week two, and he really injured it again a week ago, taking a big hit. Complete. Right over the middle of the defense, it's Davion Davis directly over the ball. This is Brandon Aubrey from 30 yards away, the converted soccer player out of Notre Dame. And I actually remember him as a soccer player. He's like himself. You definitely don't want him taking too many of those hits. Pressure coming. Cookus steps up through it. Cook is going to scramble and he takes another hit. He's been better about not taking those shots. He they may combine. It gets better. Me. Yeah. Every year that goes by, it gets a little bit better. Right up the middle here. This is going to break off some yards. Marable breaks the tackle inside the 35-yard line. He rumbles. See that little hesitation? That's allowing his offensive line to work. Magoo on the ball to his tight end. It's Thaddeus Moss. Got all the tight ends in the game here. Marable tries the middle, bounces to the outside. The ball comes out. Ball's loose. Stars are on it. Stars recover inside the five-yard line. And then the fumble. And it, it's been kind of the same rhythm for this Birmingham Stallions offense all day. Cook is trying to work opposite. <laughs> it has Coleman wide open, and Coleman has the football out across the 40. He stayed on his feet. He stayed in bounds. Crosses midfield. Corey Coleman is putting on a clinic on the outside. Ready, set. So now a first and 20. Magoo steps up through that pocket, has a receiver with plenty of room in front. It's Davion Davis. Can they catch him? Yes, they will. Ran him down at the 10. See if Jay Sternberger can find the ball Ready, on this drive. Magoo looking for his tight end, and that is reeled in for the touchdown. Look at you calling things. Jay Sternberger with the grab, with the score. Birmingham with the lead. Oh, a matchup nightmare for anyone. Here he is right here. Just going to see him get to the back of the end zone and catch this ball in the middle of the field. Watch him at the top of the route. Just attacking the defender and just separating at the last minute. Receiver and DB, they're just saying hi to each other, guys. Cookus outside complete. Circling back upfield is great. And now he takes it inside the 35-yard line before Tyree Robinson made the tackle. But a little pressure opportunity for Luis Aguilar, who has been the money man under heat. And he remains that guy. Ball set. Here's Magoo on the roll. And Magoo back to his tight end, Jay Sternberger. And Sternberger takes it inside Stars territory. And Aubrey's kick is drifting and good. <laughs> He's as minimal time on the clock for Alex Magoo in the Stallions offense as possible. Here's Cookus. Pocket is perfect and has a completion. It's Devin Gray down the sideline. Here's Cookus flushed on the roll. Complete to his running back into the end zone goes Dexter Williams. Touchdown. Philly takes the lead. In this play, just to get out of some trouble, rolls to his right. There was an all out blitz. You see, Williams almost falls to the ground but stays up, stays available. 56. Ready, set. Turf pellets. All right, here's Magoo. <laughs> and Magoo fires. That's caught Davion Davis. Play call, and it's a big one. You think they might use one of these timeouts to think about it, and they're not going to. Just going to go. Let Magoo have it. Magoo scrambles, and Magoo is complete. It's his tight end, Jay Sternberger, who has been phenomenal. Ladarius Wiley with the... Set. Here's Magoo towards the end zone and is caught for the touchdown. The go ahead touchdown it will be to the Michael Pettway. Crowds on their feet. Got open for this route again. Press coverage by Monty Dennis. Again, it's a fade route. It's a fade route. No, it's not. I'm going to break it off to the pylon. It's a good play call. A great throw by Alex Magoo. 
the Michael Petway with the great feet gets in the end zone. But it's worth a shot. Here's Cookus. Escapes the rush and launches downfield. Will make it to the 15 where it is intercepted. And this game is going to be put away by Nate Brooks. The comeback win for the Birmingham Stallions in front of the home crowd. This game was sensational. Yes, it was. Philly Stars gave it everything they had with the Birmingham Stallions. Stay on top.